Hey farmers, what's going on? Welcome back to a quick Canadian video. In this video, I'm going to be talking about how to give someone coins in the game. And before I start giving someone coins in the game, you have to decide what expansion items or what expensive items you're going to use in the game. You could use diamond rings, you could use uh, blankets, you can also use expansion materials, but since there's a limit in the game, so you cannot get more than 80. So if you're trying to transfer more coins, let's say 200,000, then using tools is not recommended. The next step that you have to do is to go to that person who whom you're trying to give coins, like I'm here at their shop and I'm purchasing the diamond rings, they're selling me in max price. So the person who is getting coins from you, they would sell you those items, whatever you're using in the max price. So we're using diamond rings because the person is level 54, so they cannot use the blankets, but using blankets is actually good. In this way, you can transfer more coins in less time. So here I'm just at their shop trying for them to sell me all the diamond rings in max price. We're going to be using 200 of them. And the next step is that I would go back to my farm shop and I would sell all these diamond rings in one coin so that the person can purchase them again. And this way they would get all the profit. So I'm selling some strawberries first because I have a lot of followers who just keep visiting my shop. So it's good to just do a little check. All right, the person's at my shop. So now I'm gonna start selling them diamond rings and I'm selling them in one coin. You have to purchase the expensive items from that person and you have to sell them back in one coin. Remember not to sell in max price, but sell in one coin. In this way, you would get the profit and you would get a loss, but still you're giving someone coins. Now, why do we transfer coins or why do you need to give someone coins? There are so many ways you could be helping your friend, you could be helping your neighbor. If you just made a baby farm and you're struggling to, you know, collect the coins and you're trying to get the machines, you can also transfer coins from your main farm to your baby farm. Uh, make sure that you have space in the barn while you're doing this transfer and also make sure that no one else is at your shop so that you don't get any loss. It's very important to uh, just keep checking your shop. And I also do not recommend putting an advertisement because someone else will get it. So that's how you give someone coins. And as you can see that I'm just giving them all the diamond rings in one coin. I gave in total 200 diamond rings. So 200 diamond rings gave almost 200,000 coins. So yep, I just sold all of the diamond rings so you guys can see and I just got one coin. So that was all about this video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Let me know if you've ever transferred or given someone coins. Don't forget to subscribe for more content. Thank you.